Hi there Aries, thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 1st of February. The Sun continues in the friendly, non-judgmental sign of Aquarius. It's asking you to think about your social interaction and the way you network with people. But there's another entirely more passionate set of influences which is still asking you to think about your role in life, the goals you have, your ambitions, and you can find yourself in quite a forceful frame of mind when it comes to achieving something that's really important for you. The key is, if you do decide to go for it, what are going to be your tactics and what's going to be the collateral damage in terms of your relationships? Because on the first day of this week, there's a quarter moon that suggests some politics can be working their way around your situation. And if you feel that you've had enough of these and you want to almost liberate yourself from them and just do what's absolutely right for you, you can, but there may be some fallout from this. Go careful in the first half of the week. Someone could find you very abrupt and, f and just over-assertive. And in the second half of the week, even if you feel that you're laying on the charm and being very tactful, someone may feel that you're just saying what they want to hear, which may not do your standing much good either. So it's going to be important to be sincere. Now, as Uranus forges a fine link with the sun in the second half of this week, it's going to get much easier to do that to really relate to people in a way which understands that their needs are different to yours, yours are different to theirs, but that's fine. That doesn't mean to say you should be on bad terms. And if you can clear the air in this kind of way, as Jupiter and Mercury combine in the second half of this week, your goals can start to come towards you that much quicker. But I do feel if you're very keen to get to where you want to go, and your elbows are sharp, whatever your tactics, there is going to be some fallout from this, which you do need to prepare yourself for. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now.